they were illegal because Congress had not set aside the money. But an appeal was filed by the Obama administration, and the payments continued. A week and a half ago, the White House announced their plan to end CSR payments to insurance companies. One day later, 18 states and the District of Columbia sued the administration. They claim the payments are required by law. CSR payments were set to go out Friday, October 20th. Those states, led by California's Attorney General, filed an emergency motion on Thursday to try and prevent the administration from stopping payments. Some 7 million people will probably be affected. Well, we went in asking for the court to give us an emergency ruling to stop what the Trump administration did last week or a little bit more than a week ago because it was supposed to, under the Trump administration, take effect immediately under their order. And we can't afford to have that kind of uncertainty. It's one piece of a health care fight that started long before President Trump stepped foot in the White House and is far from over. Uh, I think on the CSRs, what you're seeing the president say is, look, uh, I'm o I would be okay with making these payments if I get something for people in exchange, if I get something that actually helps people. President Trump is set to attend the weekly policy lunch on Capitol Hill with Senate Republicans. That's set to happen on Tuesday. The president told Fox's Maria Bartiromo he still thinks he can get the votes to repeal and replace Obamacare. Arthel? Ellison Barber, thank you.